All right guys, so I'm here at Walmart. I just started collecting these WWE figures. I'm gonna get this Edge for sure. And then for the Elites, there's some that don't come with the money in the bank briefcase. And there's some that do. I don't know what that means exactly, but I found a couple of them. I'm gonna get the Stone Cold for sure. Uh, we got Nia Jax with the briefcase. We got Neville with the briefcase and TJP with the briefcase. I'm not gonna get these, I just wanted to show them. If someone knows what that means, just let me know. I'll be getting these for sure. Here's another one with the briefcase. And you see, here he is again without the briefcase. See, we have Stone Cold there with the briefcase, and then we have another one without it. They got these SummerSlam figures as well. Seth Rollins and Dean Ambrose, but they don't have Matt Hardy. I was only gonna pick up Matt Hardy and Edge. I literally looked over and then I saw this, guys. They have the Matt Hardy here. They actually have a lot of the new SummerSlam wave. So I'm gonna get one of these for sure as well. And they have more of these basic elites. And I'm trying to see, oh, they have a Ric Flair. I'm trying to see if any of these have the briefcase. That Kurt Angle looks really good. I'm gonna pick it up. We got the Shane. They also got this display here, and I didn't notice them until now, but they have the new um, Avengers way back there. Not the new one, but, you know, Spider-Man, and they have a Colossus here. So I'm, I might pick that up. I'm hoping there's a Cyclops here too. So I'm gonna go ahead and check that out right now. Here's the other side that isn't blocked. They have Captain America, Old Man Logan, they don't have Colossus on this side or Cyclops. I also found this Brock that I'm gonna pick up and I found the Undertaker, but I don't know if I'm gonna get this one. And I found the Cyclops that I was talking about. So that's great. And then Cyclops, I don't know if I'm gonna get Cyclops. I've had him before. I've had him before too and I traded him off. Um, so I'm getting this for sure. And then the Brock and then the WWE figures. All right guys, I'm gonna end this video here. I'm just gonna briefly show you guys my collection so far. This is all the WWE figures that I have right now. First one that I ever got was this SH Figuarts Triple H. I got this Lita at TJ Maxx, $7.99. I think I showed you guys in that video. I got this uh, page at Big Lots for only $10. Uh, I heard this figure's getting hard to find, especially since the left the WWE now. I'm gonna try and stay away from the female ones as much as I can, just like I do with uh, Legends, but I have to get these two. This one's gonna look good with either Edge or Matt Hardy. I ha I got this Sheamus a long time ago at Marshalls for only $7 as well. I, I, I got it for the WWE belt, mainly. I got the SummerSlam Matt Hardy. This is the Matt Hardy that I might go with her or either this Edge right here. Edge is my favorite WWE uh, wrestler, so I had to get this for sure. And then I got the broken Matt Hardy right here. I have a basic Triple H here I got for five bucks. And this is about that came with Sheamus that I was talking about. So basically this is a chase variant. That's what I found out from talking to a few of you guys. Um, uh, I'm gonna keep it in this packaging for a while. So yeah, I got this Stone Cold. I got this Brock right here with the WWE belt and some attire. And we got the Animal Batista here really want this belt to go with my SHV URs Triple H. So yeah guys, these are going to come out of the box and be displayed. I just need to buy a, uh, a new shelf for all these figures. So thanks for watching guys and I'll see you guys in the next video.